When a kayaker recently noticed some cracks on the pillars of a local bridge, he was concerned. So we took those concerns to the Florida Department of Transportation. First Coast News Jessica Clark reports that the cracks that have other boaters alarmed, the state though says that bridge is okay. Chris Gabbia works on boats for a living and rides boats for fun along the intracoastal waterway and under the J. Turner Butler Bridge. I mean, I go under the bridge, you know, at least three, four times a week. We showed him some photos that a local boater recently took of the legs or columns of the Butler Bridge. They show large cracks in the columns. Now that you've shown me those pictures, I'm a little skeptic. Skeptic okay. of the bridge's safety. So we reached out to the Florida Department of Transportation to see how healthy the bridge is. And the report card for this bridge is actually really good. In September, the state did its latest inspection of the bridge. And for the eastbound and westbound spans, it got a 96 and a 98 out of 100. That's nearly perfect. The bridge itself is completely safe. So why are the cracks there? After talking with the bridge experts, um, that the particular cracking that you're seeing is a result of the corrosive environment there. The brackish water, according to DOT spokesman Hampton Ray, who also said the cracks are being monitored and the bridge is due for some repair at the cost of $5.4 million. Fixing the cracks will be part of that project. But they need to be looked at or taken care of, definitely. And even though the state says the Butler Boulevard Bridge is safe, Gebbia will be thinking twice about going underneath it. If it looks like that, yeah, I'd be pretty nervous going under it from here on in. Jessica Clark, First Coast News, on your side.